What's your name? So I can't you handle can't the business. Take my face off the camera. You cannot film her if she says don't film her. <laughs> so you're gonna you're gonna tell it. You want to educate these women on the First Amendment? Since We're not giving you permission, like you said. It doesn't matter. You're in public. You're in public. You're in public. I don't think so. You're in public. I would like my service. Sir, as long as he's filming me, I'm not helping him, and I'm trying to help my other customer. How much you'd like your phone? I love this phone. Why? Okay, you keep recording. I'm going to take it. I'm going to show your phone. Yeah? You, you, yeah? yeah? You're going to take my phone, huh? Yeah. I didn't get educated. I think you're an ass. I think you're a fucking ass. That's why I think you're right. You're really? right. I'm not be on camera and being trampled right. What the hell? Go take on, that yeah. camera out of my face! Correct. You are expressing your constitutional correct rights. You understand? That is correct. So we are just educating the public to make sure that they are accurate to what you can I'm do. I'm hoping so. Okay. When you stand up for your rights, you stand up for the rights of everyone. When you give up your rights, you put everyone else's rights in jeopardy. Welcome back to San Joaquin Valley Transparency. This video was sent to me by the Angry Vet. You guys are absolutely going to love this guy's channel without a doubt. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. We'll pause for some comments and I'll give you my final thoughts at the end. All right, folks, here we go. So we're at the, uh, I got some business to take care of here. Oh, we're going to have problems. I can see it already. Hello. Hi. Take a of. It's the building and services that you offer and all. And I got uh, some business I need to take care of. What type of business that, are you in? Is that okay? It depends on what kind of business you're in. Right. Really? How we can help you. Mm -hmm. Um, well right now I'm just taking pictures and video. Are you with the news or something? Um, yeah, I guess you could say that. Yeah, I'm an independent journalist. Alright, well then I have okay. to call my district manager because we're not supposed to be having no video taken. Mm -hmm. Really? You didn't ask permission yes. on top of that, you just started taking pictures. Don't take my picture. Yes. Don't please. take my I'm picture. I'm sorry. Because I can have you sued for that. You, you can? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I can have you sued too, and I can show everybody online just who you are. Really? So, I, oh, no, so you, you can, can take my picture. So you can do it. Picture. So you can do it, but I can't. I won't do it unless you. But I already told you that I didn't like it. I don't want you taking my but, picture. But so, so you can. So you can do it, but I can't. No, that's I what you're I saying. I don't want to do it, but I want to see who's taking my picture so I can show it. That I've asked oh, you politely. I'm sorry. To not take my what, uh, what, what's your name? <laughs> what? You're going to need to get out. Oh. You're going to need to get out. I'm done. Right, you, you're, you didn't you're, a pu you're, you're a public employee, aren't you? You work no. You work for Maryland? You don't no. work You don't no. work for the, no. the You're contracted to the state. So this isn't public property? What do you mean is this? This isn't owned by the state? It is owned by the state, but we're contracted. Right. So it's public property. But you are right? not authorized to take video. I most certainly am. You just started taking it, and I told you specifically. Uh, again, telling me, don't take my picture. I'm most certain. Well, I'm here to conduct business, and, uh, well, you're refusing to, to let, me, let me do my business? Who is that? Who is that? Her name is Lori. It's my Lori. boss. Please take me off the camera. <laughs> Hello, Miss Lori. Hi. How are How are you? He's got the phone up to his ear. What? How? How? How is it? How is it against the law to? To He's not what? He's not supposed to be 
Yeah. Hold on. You know what? The police are here. They'll 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 educate you. Yeah. This is this is their boss. Here, you want to talk to their boss? No. Okay. That's Miss Lori. An officer actually just walked. What What's the issue? I have no idea. I just came in to do some business, and they're getting they're getting crazy on me. I did okay. actually. I did say. I did. I did say what I was doing. You're probably they're not going to do business with you while you're recording. Nope. They're not going to. She's calling mm. our operations manager right now. So really? I can so, help you, sir. so I can't Please handle the business. Take my face off the camera. I'm, are you not a public employee? A you're public not, you're, employee she might be, but right. you can still be. You are a public with official. Her if she does not want to be on your camera. You cannot film her if she says don't film her. Really? Who are you? My name is Officer Morgan. And your badge number? 027. I have never seen this many crazy people in one place before. This has to be one of the most insane videos that I've ever seen. But the end is going to be extremely good. So don't skip any of the video. And don't leave without watching the whole thing. Alright folks, keep watching. And you're telling me that... Because she doesn't want to be filmed, she I'm not allowed. Filmed, you can't film her now. And that's no. against the law. Yes, it is. It really, really. Yes, it is. What law is that? Uh, it's it's on the books. It's on what book? You're invading her privacy. Really? Yeah. Um, in a public area. This is a state That's building. not a public area. That's and this most area. this most certainly is a public area. This is. That's not. You can't just arbitrarily walk back behind the counter because you feel that it's a public who, area. Who walked behind the counter? No one. Okay, so yeah. what am I doing wrong again? Uh, you're filming them and they don't want to be filmed. Well, uh, uh, tough do noogies. You have business? So, you have I do have business, but they won't. They won't take care because of it. So why, why, why are you being like this? You're a, you you are an officer of the law, correct? That's correct. So you swore an oath. Absolutely. To uphold the Constitution, correct? That's correct. So why aren't you doing it? I am doing it. Really? Yeah. Well, so what? Exactly. Explain to me what you're doing. I'm then. not explaining anything to you. You don't have to explain I don't anything have to me. To explain anything to you. Do you know what the First Amendment is? Absolutely. And you, you are you do, doing this as a part of your job? Do you, or are you just doing it for shits and giggles? I'm recording my transact. I was going to record my transaction, but these ladies are are can, being ignorant. They very much refuse to do business. With really, you. they yes, can refuse they can. business. They Absolutely, really. So you're gonna you're gonna tell him. So you're gonna tell him that. So you want me to leave? Is that what? Yes, until you turn that camera you want, off. So yes. what? Am I trespassing now? Is that what I'm doing now? Since they want me to leave, am I trespassing now? That's up to them. Sir, we really? So then, what, what's going to happen? Because I'm not leaving until I get my business taken care of. Well, you don't need to state your business, sir. Exactly. I, I have stated. I have stated. I have stated my business. What is your business? I told you I'm an independent journalist working on a story. You didn't say. You just say independent journalist, and I asked you. Okay. Well, I'm working on. Yeah, well, I don't have to have permission. Don't don't have to have permission. Yes, you do. And I would like to take care of my other business that I came in to do. Not as long as you have that camera on. Okay, well, why 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 would why would you uh, send me a letter? Why would admission send me a letter two weeks after I got my car emissioned, saying 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 that uh, my registration is going to be canceled? Why would you do that when I have a a passing piece of paper in my glove box. Why, why would y'all do that? I don't have to answer that question you don't, as long as I You don't want to help me with my problem? Not as long as I can. So you'd rather my uh, registration get canceled than, than help me, huh? As long as that camera's on, I'm not answering no questions. I'm not helping you. Whether I get fired or not. I Whether you get... Oh, so you don't care about your job. That's I great. Care about my job. That's beautiful. You want to educate these women on the First Amendment? Since you took it, since you know, well, why don't you educate me then, since you know everything, Officer You're Morgan? You're standing here recording. You educate yourself. I, I've already educated myself. That's okay. why I'm here. Okay. Okay. That's why I'm here. You have no business with me, so I have no business with you. I don't have any business with you? Nope. You're an officer of the law. You're a peacekeeper, correct? Right. You're a peacekeeper, right. correct? Right. So maybe you should keep the peace. They're doing well. You're, you're, are you a sergeant or a corporal? Corporal. You're a corporal, mm -hmm. and you don't know about the First Amendment. I didn't say that. 
Well, clearly you don't because you're not you're not taking care of the situation. You're not you're not de-escalating any of this. Facility. I'm the local town police. I you're have local no town police. Here, you have no jurisdiction in this town, is what you're no, saying, you're not Officer Morgan. Go ahead, call the state police. They're, they, they'll educate you. They'll educate you. See, I can't record, but she can. And do you do you realize? You're you're breaking your policy and procedures right now as a government employee hey, um, by filming and recording on your personal private phone. Where are you going, Officer Morgan? It's a state. It's a town cop. It's not even state police. It's a town cop. It's not even without jurisdiction. He doesn't have jurisdiction here. He's he's calling calling his supervisor. I think. Are you calling your supervisor, Corporal? Wow. North Northeast Emissions Department, Maryland, refused to service me and my issue with them. This is this is cute. So are you calling the police, ma'am? Because clearly you see that police officer's not gonna not gonna help you. Wow. Wow. Oh man, they're gonna love this. I wish I had more viewers. Sir, I'm asking you to not come from Anna County. Excuse me? Don't come from behind that county. Who said I was coming behind the counter? You're warning me? You hear that? She's calling the state police on me now. Miss Monica, who refused to identify herself, but now we know. And we got this other Yahoo over here that uh, seems to think I'm I'm breaking people's privacy. Yeah, clown getting in his car to go now, isn't he? This is incredible, unbelievable. Police Northeast. We're gonna get his tag number. Northeast Police Department. Northeast Police. Miss Monica, can I get some assistance, please? As long as you are filming me, I am not helping you, sir. I'm well, I'm not. You know, the way you've acted now, if you'd asked me that politely, I, you know, maybe I would have uh, complied. But you're 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 being kind of a of an asshole. I'm not being an yeah, asshole. Yeah, you are. It's a dereliction of duty, really, to be honest with you. No, it's not. Sure is. You have you have some standards to uphold as a as a government employee, don't you? I'm not a government employee. I'm contracted no. to the state. That's yeah, that's okay. the state's government. So here we are. Are Miss Monica? Are the police coming? Okay, so we'll wait for the police. You asked me to leave? Are you trespassing me? <laughs> this is kind of funny. Do as I say, not as I do. Is that, is that right? You can't film me. <laughs> oh my goodness. nice and warm in here. I think I will uh, take a seat. Well, Corporal 
Morgan, I guess we'll have to uh, handle that. Miss Monica, can we just please at least no, take care of this filming. business? I told, no, I, as huh? long as you're filming, I'm not helping you. Do you do you understand the expectation of privacy when you're a government employee? Hmm. I've already told you we're not government employees. Here. Yeah, you oh, are. You're contracted state. by the state. That makes you a government official. No, I don't get their benefits. <laughs> oh well. You know, you're working for the state. You should act accordingly. I am acting accordingly. Our our policy is you come in here recording, we have to call our district manager. This is a state facility. Well, you we just... don't want recording. Well, I don't want to be on camera. I don't want to be recorded. So I'm shutting up now until the state police get here because I have asked you to leave. Well, I'll, I'll, you know, well, why don't you call your district manager again and put her on speakerphone? I'd love to hear what she has to say about it. Well, I'd love for everybody else to hear what she has to say about it, honestly. When did they say they were caught? Did they say they were on their way? They said they were sending somebody in there. Did they tell you anything on the phone about uh, recording in public or anything of the such? They said something, and I told them I had asked you to leave, and you're not leaving, so they are sending somebody out. Oh. Oh, shit. Here's the, look at this. Notice to the public your rights under Title VI, Civil Rights Act. What's it say? Oh. Is that your boss? Mm. A little, little something for you. Well, I wasn't expecting this, but hey, I'm sure this will get some views. How you doing? One of the things I've said before is try not to screw around with the people or mess around with the common man, try to educate them. But if those people start acting crazy with you, absolutely pan the camera over to them and do what it is you got to do to let them know that they're acting like idiots. And that's exactly what the angry vet is doing. This is a really good First Amendment audit, folks. Keep watching. They're not helping anybody at, the, at this particular moment because I'm recording, so they don't want to help anybody. I'm trying to, trying to get help myself, and they don't want to help. I'm sorry, sir. We cannot help people if he's still recording. We've asked them to leave. So you're, so you're, so you're going to refuse this man's services, too, just because I'm, I'm recording? Personal business. If that gentleman is wanting to come have something done here, then you're you're um, putting his personal business out there. I'm not putting his personal business out there. You just said you was gonna put it for your viewers. You said you had people view. I said my viewers are gonna love this denial of refusal of refusal of service. Right not only to me, but now you're refusing service to somebody that you doesn't even. Live right now, sir. Yes, he is. I know he is. Uh, really? Oh, so you're going to help him, but not me. This is going to look real good on you, Miss Monica. This is going to look real good Take on you. Take that camera out of my face! In my opinion, the two workers there need to get fired. And isn't it funny how sometimes when you ask a police officer, can I have your badge number? And they don't give it to you. And then you turn around and ask another police officer if you can have their badge number. And they don't give it to you either. That's what we're seeing in this video. One woman thinks she could tell you to stop recording. And now the other one is acting crazy too. Police officers and public officials, if you're watching this video right now, try to lead by example. Because once you start acting like a knucklehead, you're going to have your other co-workers acting like knuckleheads too. And they're going to think that they can behave just like you. And this video keeps getting worse and worse, folks. <laughs> Don't leave. Keep watching. Man, you got some anger issues. Monica, did you take your medicine this morning? Hindering me helping my other customers because he wants to keep the camera in my face, Lori. 
I'm already asking you to get the camera out of my face. And because I want to help my other customer, he's saying, oh, this is going to be fun for his, his, his audience. No, I said, this is going to look real good on you, helping other people before you help me. Just because I have a camera in my hands. I'm sorry? I'm sorry about this. I'm just trying. You mean? If they want to help you, if you put the camera down, they can help you. No, I, I want help I mean, while I, I want to record my transaction. I should be allowed to do Sir, that. I, I will be right with you, okay? I'm, I, as long as I've asked this gentleman to leave, I'm waiting for the state police to get here. No, you're fine. Take, so, I, are you just here to be tested or you need help too? Uh, I need a new date. Can you give me a few minutes, yep. please? Because I'm not, he's before you guys, but as long as he's filming me, I refuse to help him. Okay. So, my district manager is calling my operations manager and... Sorry, guys. I, I think you're the one that's going to be in trouble, Fred. Really? I think so. Why would you think that? Because they're bringing the cops. Well, why, why would you think I would be in trouble, though? Because you're filming in a state Thank place. you, in a state yes. facility. Is that illegal? And I've yes. asked yes. him to take the camera off. No. Thank you. No, it's not illegal. I've asked him to take turn the camera off. I would be more than happy to help him. Oh, well, we're, we're all... We're all going to get an education today. When as soon as the state police come, well, everybody's going to be educated. Or stop filming me. That's the reason they're coming out. It's a state facility. You have to have permission to come in here. No, I don't. Film. Yes, no, I don't. Do. It's public property. All right. How much do you like that phone? I'm sorry. I said, how much do you like the phone? I love this phone. Why? Okay, you keep recording. I'm going to take it. And I'm going to show you your phone. Yeah. You, you, yeah. yeah? You're going to yeah. take my phone, huh? Yeah. yeah, you got that on video too, right? Yeah. Go ahead. Take my phone. Go ahead and take my phone. Yes, I have. What is the issue anyway? I mean, why, why do you have to film? I guess I'm, I'm questioning it. Huh? I'm just asking. Why? Because it's my First Amendment right. To film this is a constitutionally protected activity. I know, but what is, what is it that you're getting here anyway? I was just wanted to record my transaction. What transaction? The transaction that I came here to take care of. What was that? The denial of the, the the denial of my registration because they say my car isn't it isn't didn't get tested when I got it tested two weeks ago and passed. That's my business. So, uh, you gonna take my phone or what? Well, did I ask you to record me? Did I? Did I? Ask I don't need your permission. I, you you started talking to me. Did I ask to be brought in your business? No, you, you, started no, yes. you, you started talking to me. You started you started talking to me. You started talking to me, pal. Now, did I ask you to be brought in your business? No, I did. Yeah, not. you did. No, you. Yeah, you told me it was illegal to record. No, you, you said, oh, it's, it's illegal to record in the state, plus, so right, now I'm recording listen, you. Plus, you, you filmed no. him before that, and you filmed me, too. Yeah, well. Without our permission. Okay. Well, I'll film you, too. Okay. I mean, yeah. but you're not, we're not giving you permission, like you said. It doesn't matter. Not, you're in public. Steve you're in public. Did not you're in public. I don't think so. Him. You're in public. Oh, I'm in public. So you're, you're in public. In public. So you get there is no me. expectation right. of privacy in public, okay. bud. But you're about to learn. We'll yeah. You're about to learn when the state trooper shows up. Yeah. You're hindering my job. And yeah. you're, you're starting no, I'm, I'm, I'm you're being not, threatened. You're going to be taken out of here. Yeah, you threaten me, pal. No, you threaten me. I dare you, know. you to touch me. I dare you. Phone. I dare you to I take my phone. phone. Go ahead and take my phone, pal. Yeah. You're, you're, you're a real tough guy. Let's see how tough you are. Yeah. Let's see how tough you're you tough are. you tough guy holding that phone right, right now. That's you're right. You're tough guy, right? You are. No, he's disturbing, and she's disturbing. Yeah. She's trying to do her job. He's starting arguments. He's hindering my job. He's starting arguments with other customers. I can't do my job. I need them here now. I'll call him myself. Go ahead, call him. Y'all are going to get an education today. Every single one of you. And this guy, this guy threatening me. Hi, this is 
I'm going to find out. I'm going to find out. All right. So another threat. How am I going to find out? What am I going to find out? Speaking, it's freedom of speech, right? Yeah. Hey, so same, free. same with this. Free, freedom of press. Same, same thing. So you like your rights, but you don't like mine. All right. You like yours, but you don't like mine. I'll handle it elsewhere. You'll handle it elsewhere. How's that? Mm -hmm. just where, where are you going to handle it? I got my dog in for. This one's already told them it's against the law and state buildings. It is. It is against it the is. law. Wrong. No, it's not. Wrong, and you're going to get educated. Wrong. Ago. You're going to get educated today. I'm very educated. Uh, you know what? If the police want to violate my rights, let, let them do it. Let them, let them violate my rights, but you're not going to violate my rights. I'd be damned if I let you, uh, I'll be you violate my rights. I'll be damned if I let you violate my rights. Or stop filming, then I'll be more than happy to help you, but... Alright. I bet. And we got this guy calling the police because he thinks he knows better. And we got this guy threatening me. I didn't hear no threat. Well, I bet you didn't. It's on camera. He just asked you to put your phone away. It's all on camera. Not once did I threaten you. Yeah, you, you did. Yeah, you did. His camera off his camera out your face? <laughs> Okay. So, I, I told him I was going to shatter the phone for, for video me is what I said and I will shatter the phone go ahead and shatter the phone do it do it yeah. you're, you're edging it on you're edging it on really yeah no I'm just standing no, up from, no. I'm standing up for myself you're you want to keep you want to keep making the threats they First sound. They all, sound like. Em, they sound like. To, they sound right? like empty threats to me. By sitting there edging it on, it's threatening. Right? Oh, really? Really? Yeah. I suggest you just shut the fuck up. All right. All right. You and everything will be fine. Yeah. Well, you're sitting Why wouldn't it be? Tell these ladies how to do their job when yeah. they're doing it. Yeah, no, they're, no, they're clearly, do they're clearly not doing there, their job. You? Clearly, they aren't doing their job, well, or I'd have been out of here by now. If you, if you knew how to do it, wouldn't you be over there on the other side of the counter? You're not. All right. Uh -huh. They're doing their job. Clearly, they're to clearly, they're not doing their job because I'd have been gone by now. I, I'd have been, I'd have been out of here. I would have helped you, but you didn't. I asked you to leave, and you didn't. So guess what? What? My boss already knows I'm, I, you're hindering me from helping these other two yeah. customers okay. because you've got this camera in my face. Did you learn something? Did the police tell you something? It's everybody here. Don't worry about it. Okay. Just won't deal with it. All right. They were already in their way. Yeah, they're right there. Where? Oh, here they come. Here they Y'all hear video too. Here they come. Y'all hear a video. I am going to video. Tell the guy you are. Okay. Come on, get that on. All right. Camera. All right, folks. So the cops show up on scene. And the first cop that was there earlier, he was a straight idiot. But you're going to see how this cop right here talks to him. And I got to tell you, you got to hand it to this cop. He did an outstanding job. Keep watching the video, folks. Hmm. Sounds like she's getting educated. You two might want to listen to this conversation.
call you. Hello? But unfortunately, it is. Hmm. Constitutional right. Did you hear that? You heard that, right? Look, I don't know why you and I have to have a problem. I, I apologize to you for their behavior. And you, 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 you fucking threatened me three fucking times, bro. Bro, I don't have... Three times. The f problem is, I want to just come in, do my shit, and get the hell so out. So did I. I want to sit there and fucking throw a fucking video on my face. Come on now. You started talking to me. You had the fucking thing over here. You no, told you me it was illegal. Me. No, you, you started see? talking to me. Right, but I wasn't Dude, videotaping you when I was I, talking to you. I, I, I didn't know what the fuck was going on. You keep me out of it. Well, you got an issue with somebody, you got an issue with somebody. Don't break somebody else's stay the fuck out of it. You didn't do, do my, then you throw the video in my fucking face. Because you're the one that said it was illegal. Out. You said it was illegal to, to no, record the state. You took a fucking state, video of me. State, pro fucking state property, you said it was Get illegal. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, okay. All right. How you doing? Uh, hold on. Since How you doing? Here, How you doing, Trooper Proctor? How you doing? I'm, I'm, I'm doing? letting everybody know that you're being audio vision recorded by myself and Trooper Steinmetz. And me. And me. So, okay. Sir, and me. why don't you do me a favor? Go talk to Trooper Steinmetz for me real quick. And then I'm going to talk to this gentleman right here. Okay. I'm going to read I'm right here. I'm Trooper Steinman, ID number 7290, being all of recorded, okay? How you doing, Trooper? The reason we're out here is everybody's calling in regards to you coming That's, and filming. That is correct. You are expressing your constitutional correct rights, you understand? That is correct. So we are just educating the public to make sure that they are accurate to what you can I'm do. hoping so. Okay. This all guy's right. threatened me three times already. I understand. It, it, People's emotions get I high. completely understand. I tried to apologize to them when they first came in. I get that. I said, hey, look, guys, I'm sorry that they're not helping you, but they're not helping you because of me. Mm -hmm. You know, I was straight up with them. I'm like, I'm filming. Yeah. And that's why these girls aren't helping you. I got you. And so, then they get pissed off and they get start getting yeah. mad at me. Yeah. And then everybody and that, you know, gets high. And yeah. So yeah. So and so, I'm not I'm not too keen about this guy threatening me three times, though. Well, yeah. he said, huh? well, wait a minute, Trooper. Mm -hmm. You know, he told me I'm not going to handle it because then I put my body cam on. That kind of stopped him in his tracks a little bit. And he started cooling down a little bit. Okay. And, uh... And then he said, well, you know what? I'll handle it. I'll handle it outside. I'll handle it another way. Threatening me as if he's going to follow me or handle it another way. Okay. You see what I'm saying? And I don't appreciate that. I don't take threats kindly. I understand. In the state of Maryland, uh, we can't enforce anything. I'm not asking you to enforce say, anything. Yeah. All I'm saying We're is... We're going to just have just, people go I'm documenting way. it. Yep. I'm putting it on record so you know... That's understandable. Okay. I got you. And she's she's refusing service. We've, we've she's refusing my service. We've explained it to them on the fact of uh, what what needs to be done. Uh, she has her supervisors being contacted, so we can explain it as well. To I'm them. just trying to get my shit squared away. You know. That's all I'm trying to do. You're trying to do missions or. Yeah, I had I had emissions done two weeks ago. I get a letter in the mail three days ago saying that my registration's being canceled. Gotcha. I got a passing piece of paper in my glove box, you know. So I'm, t I'm here to t I'm here to take care of that, and they won't they won't take care of me. So that's that's all that's all that is. And then these two clowns Understand. jump in, and Understand. I. And then I got I got upset mm -hmm. when she started helping them instead of me, and I was like, you know what, that's kind of shitty. I said, it's gonna look real good with your bosses You're helping other people and not helping me. Mm -hmm. Yada yada yada, yeah. et cetera, et cetera, whatever. As long as I, I'm glad you guys are here to educate. That's right. That's, I mean, that's a job every day, day in and day out.
As I was coming up here, I saw you guys sitting at the uh, together. Both of you were sitting uh, on the other side at the barracks. No, I wasn't. I was just on another call. Oh, okay. With a civil matter that you know we, we just had to educate them again on what's, yeah. what's criminal and what's civil. Yeah. So again, uh, daily operations. Well, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry you guys had to come out here and deal with this four. crap. That's, that's all. Everybody just, you know, uh, emotions get heated and then we go from there. Well, I hope she takes care of me. Please go out. I would like my service. Sir, as long as you filming me, I'm not helping you and I'm trying to help my other customer. Oh my God, this is crazy. Oh my God! You see what I'm dealing, what I've been dealing with for the last 20 minutes, half hour, bro. But well, it's not voice. <laughs> well, I mean, you you got educated too, right? I didn't get educated. I think you're an ass. I think you're a fucking ass. That's what I think. Yeah, a lot Excuse of my language. But a lot of people, a lot of people have, have called me that. Well, I mean, you enjoy it. I, I, you have a right to enjoy it, being, yeah. you know. I mean. We're humans. We're all human beings just trying to live day to day. We don't need this. Right, and uh, our rights shouldn't be trampled on, right? Rights. And don't, nobody transfer your rights. You really? My rights not be on camera is being trampled on. Right. What the hell? <laughs> and they don't want to do shit. It's called the First Amendment. And my First Amendment is not to get that fucking camera out of my face. Oh my God. Ma'am, just complete your job. So I don't want my face on camera. I would yeah. like to take care of my business hey, that I came here for. Look, I've done told you. You turn the camera off, I'd be more than happy to help you, but you're not recording me. Oh, my God. That's my First Amendment right. No, actually, it's not. You're in public. There is no expectation of privacy. Ma'am, please, please continue your okay, process you. or have another worker come and help you. Okay. You're going to have to yeah. have access to this computer. And okay. I'm not, as long as it's filming me, I just wanted to take care of my business. I'd have been gone a half an hour ago. What was that to you? Hello, my team. Well, well first of all, he, yeah. the other him. gentleman told him to stop. I told him to yes, stop. And then he's I'm backing sure. up and doing this. And I said, you're not going to do that. And then, you know, he, the other gentleman said, I'm going to grab your phone and I'm going to break it. And then That's what the other gentleman told me. Yeah. And he, he then, I don't know what he pulled out of his pocket or something. And then he said, okay, ready? Come at me, you know, basically. So I, I turned mean, my body cam on. I mean, he's right. like, I said he was inciting him to come after him. Oh, that right there? But okay. Whatever. I, I was over there, sir. Okay. So I, he Did he make me. any physical threats to saying that he's going to cause any kind of physical harm or anything like that to you? No, other than I'm going to get an education. Okay. I'm getting an education. Okay. Because, like I said, Aaron, we've already, I've already been trying to explain it to everybody. I've had, I've had to talk to everybody. No, I, I understand. With, within a state facility, there's his constitutional right. He is allowed to record. That's right. Okay. But he doesn't have to service him, I guess, if he doesn't want to. Well, that's up to the, that's, exactly. a, that's up to management and them. Right. Okay, exactly. that's and that's not so, well that's not well something well. that I can say. Right. Who's but, going, but who's the, going to the issue here? Is he go? Going going to the other guy? Yeah. The other gentleman that was in the yellow? Yeah. Uh, he left already. The high visible. Yeah. yeah. Do we have his information? Yeah, he, but then he, it's he just it's disturbing. I mean, if, if I went in and did that in, in the store, I mean, public place. But that but that's also a different thing. That's probably uh, right. or private, yeah, private, a yeah. private business or anything. When you were at a state facility or, you know, uh, a place along these lines, then they have the constitutional so, right to go so and do that. what does the if gentleman he, want? Anyway? If he was a... Uh, I haven't, I, haven't, I, haven't, I haven't spoke to him yet. This uh, gentleman right here. He has a problem with his vehicle license, and he's trying to get it taken care of. I don't see any paperwork. So I mean, I have paperwork. Where's his paperwork to show that he's are, got are a you business? Getting, are you All I need is a tag sir, number. Sir, are you getting work done on your vehicle? Or are you going to have no. uh, your vehicle on? Uh, no, my, uh, no, that's not the problem he, I'm having. He had, uh, okay. he had an admission test passed, but then uh, something was wrong with yeah. the registration in which he got some yeah. mail, so he's trying to get it figured out here. Well, re registrations have to be taken care of. I mean, two we, weeks, two weeks ago. Yeah, explain uh, to me what happened. Sir. So, uh, like, maybe even more than that, three weeks ago. Okay. 
and, and that's the that's the problem, officer. I don't think that he has an issue here. I don't think he has business. I do right? have business here. I do. Okay. Well, you haven't I demonstrated do. that you do. Okay. What? Well, First off, yeah. I don't need to. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. I don't want you two interacting with each other right no, now. No, I'm, I'm trying to diffuse I'm everything for everybody. Make it make I'm everything nice and peaceful. Okay. You're gonna wait where for me? Hey. See another threat. Another threat. Explain to me what you were trying to get done today. See if I can try. I wanted to document that. my transaction. Um, I was at the VA hospital. Okay. And instead of, and I wanted to get to an admissions place before they closed, and I didn't think I had time to get all the way to Forest Hill, you know. So you this was get, the closest you need, you one. You need to get your vehicle inspected through the vehicle admissions. No. Program. What happened is I got my vehicle, and so I got a notice saying I needed my admissions done. I got it done. Okay. It passed. Okay. Put the letter in the in the, uh, the the pass thing right in the glove box. Okay. Two weeks later, two maybe a little more, maybe three, two to three weeks later, I get another notice in the mail saying they're canceling my registration. Okay. So I come up from here the okay. from because I didn't. Because this, this was a letter the, from the, the admissions the, place. The, the MBA saying that they didn't get your admissions. Is that what they're saying they were canceling it for? I, think so. It okay. said emissions, well, yada, yada, yada. So I wanted to come up here okay. and give her my tag number, get another copy of the pass thing in case that disappeared somehow or whatever. So you don't have the and one that you put in your glove box? Okay. It, sh it should be, but I don't have the car because we're selling it. It's all That car is in Moncton. Gotcha. Okay. Car's in well, Moncton. Let me explain something that does happen with the MBA at times. Okay, Sometimes there may be a lapse from the time that it does get inspected and that, that paperwork or whatever makes it. Well, that's why I'm here, to make sure that everything's square and taken care of and everybody knows about it that I have a pass. Okay. And that should be in their system. But that it passed like two, three weeks ago. See if I can help you out with that, okay? That would so be great. Normally, normally when your tags get suspended or canceled or anything along those lines, you have to speak with the people up at MBA. It hasn't been canceled yet. It was telling me that I have until the 30th or they're going to cancel my shit. Yeah, to get the emissions. Shit, to, to get yep, the, to get the emissions. emissions exactly. Okay. So that's okay. why I'm here to get... Yeah. That way, if it does screw up or okay. fuck up what somehow, if, then I can if, shove that piece of paper up their ass and be like, hey. If they do have, I'm going to ask them in hearing, if they do have the documentation that you did get your vehicle inspected recently. They should. See if we can get an extra copy of that, yep. and then you have to take that up to the NBA. Because that would be great. What usually happens is it automatically gets forwarded up there. Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, let me see if I can get that squared away. That would be okay? fantastic. So, Thank you. What's your tag number? Um, do you have it? Yeah. Do you have your ID on you, sir? Yeah, I'm not giving you my ID. Hold on, I'll give you my tag number. Is the vehicle registered to you? Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Um, Alright, folks, so this concludes our video, and here's my final thoughts. The Angry Vets channel is going to grow extremely fast. He did an outstanding job on this video, and I've seen a couple other videos, and they're done very well. And I did like the way these cops knew and understood exactly what this man's rights are. And first and foremost, I got to say thank you to all you First Amendment auditors out there educating. I guess I'll pat myself on the back as well because I was one of the first channels to do it. I wasn't the first, but I was one of them. And it's been fun, guys. Educating folks and educating cops has been a blessing for me and my family. Many of you guys have been watching me for a long time, so you know what I'm talking about. And before I let you guys go and subscribe to the Angry Vets channel, I want to teach you guys the First Amendment of the Constitution if you don't know yet. So if you're a police officer, please try to emulate what this cop right here did and said. So here we go, folks. The First Amendment of the Constitution. You have a freedom of religion, freedom of press, freedom of speech, freedom to assemble, and the freedom of petition. Those five elements of the First Amendment mirror your natural rights these rights that you were born with. That means the founding fathers who wrote this document knew and understood how important your rights were, your natural rights. Now understand that these documents, they don't give you your rights. These documents are there to limit the scope of authority that public officials have over you, the people. No wonder the cops don't know it. No wonder the cops laugh at you when you say you know it. And I gotta tell you, these cops, what they're doing and they don't seem to know this yet, is they're actually laughing at their own kids and their grandkids when they try to use their rights. They're happily taking away the rights of their own family members. And like I said, they don't seem to know and understand this yet. But that's why my channel here is extremely important. And that's why the Angry Vets channel is extremely important. So I will drop the Angry Vets channel link in the description and in the pinned comment. And if you guys can't find it there, just type it in on your Google search or your YouTube search and you'll find them there. 
Go subscribe. Let them know San Joaquin sent you. I will see you guys over there. You guys have yourselves a Merry Christmas. Thank you all for tuning in. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.